Hey, good afternoon. Once again, I am at the countryside somewhere to explore the countryside world. And、um, again, with my favorite slingshot. So I sort of like this scoured a bit of a、um, rice paddies here. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with my slingshot here, but let just explore around a bit. All right, here you go. Yeah, it's um really really beautiful palm tree. At the back of my、um, my background here, right? Um, just um, beautiful, beautiful.、Um, the reason I came here because、um, some of my friend he invited me come to see him plowing his rice rice field. So so I'll show you in a bit later. All right. So, but for now, just look at the view around me. The sky is just so stunning, so stunning. And if you look at the right paddy, there is no tree. It's so flat, very flat. Cambodia, most of it, it's very, very flat country. Not really mountainous. Um, but flood and flood, always flood every、uh, rainy seasons. Okay, right. This is just amazing here. Oh, I love it, love it to be back at the countryside once again. All right, I'm gonna show you、uh, where they are plowing the rice fields. All right. Cheers! Just so amazing, sunny. Right, this is the、um, yeah. This is the amazing clouds here. It's I think it's going to be storm, storm for some reason. Again, you can read a cloud、uh, sign and. The the clouds or the sky will tell you what's happening today or the next minutes or the next hours. So it is good to read the cloud sign. So right now it is a kind of like it's so cloudy, and this is a a storm clouds. Apparently, you can see a bit of darker. So that mean it's going to rain for some reason. So we'll see today. All right. Let's um. Let's see where they are plowing. Going to plow the rice field. It's amazing. Um, this is the rice field. It's so flat, so you can see. This is the the border between one owner and other. So this is the border divided、um, different owner. So here, for example,、uh, owner A, and if you across this border, it's owner B, right? But the thing is, people just burn down because the right field. People just burn the tree down, which is not good at all.、Um, but well, and plus now they use the machinery.、Uh, they they don't use animal at all. All、right before, we use a、um, a buffalo or ox to plow 
the rice field. But now, now we use this. This is called machine ox. Machine ox, right? So we use this instead of the uh, animal. So yeah, this is just amazing here. I love it. This is reminding me a bit of a, when I was young, just running around the rice field naked with my uh, brother, which is he, yeah, he passed away a uh, long, long time ago, which is really sad. But anyway, that's, that's life. Yeah, this is it. This is the um, call, um, we call it, sorry, uh, um, machine ox. Machine ox. So we don't use any animal strength anymore. So we use this, this machine instead of it. In a way, it's really good, but another way it's um we lost our traditional uh you know uh method so when you plow you make sure that you don't you don't miss you don't miss anything here um if you miss it it's going to be not good for rice so everything has to be perfect plow yeah it's amazing oh just beautiful oh just incredible all right i'm gonna show you a explain you a bit here yeah this is a long way long long way okay um i don't know if you can see it it's going to be so long way. This is a really long right paddy. Um, I don't know how I'm going to stand it here. But alright, I'm going to do it like that. This way. Yeah, it's just incredible, isn't it? Incredible. Right, for some reason, someone's going to plow the ground so then you can see how it works. That ox machine. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Welcome to Scrap Ida channel. With this is favorite slingshot and beautiful countryside. And you gotta see the people plowing the rice field, which they use the ox machine. Let's see it now. Ooh. There you go. That's um that's how they plow it. So um let's see it. Yeah, just like that. Yes. Woohoo! Nice one. Yeah, let's see how they do it here. From here, All right? Let's try to um, catch them. With my slingshot, always. I always go anywhere with my slingshot because I I love it. You know, I love it when I was about six years old. So I still use it now. So it is my favorite tool in the world to survive in the countryside yeah Woo -hoo! all right i'm gonna see you in a bit when a it rains or not today but thank you for your watching and uh if you like please subscribe to my channel or comment below all right cheers happy weekend from cambodia